Welcome to John's Jeep Garage. Hi, welcome to John's Jeep Garage. Today we're working on a Jeep Wrangler TJ. That is a 1997 to 2006 year model Jeep. We're working on the rear brake light or tail light. It's the same bulb. And we're just gonna show you how to access it, remove it, reinstall it, and be on your way. Uh, that's the scope of the video. We're not troubleshooting any other electrical problems, just replacing the bulb. Thank you for watching. So even though a brake light bulb and the tail light bulb is the same bulb, on this example, the lights are on, but the passenger side bulb is out. So we're going to access it. You're going to need a Phillips screwdriver. There's four screws. Uh, we're going to put this on fast speed. Um, you're going to remove the outside lens cover. So you're going to need to pull the lens cover off. I just use one of the screw holes to get a grip to pull it out. Now be careful because there's a gasket and you don't want to rip it. It just seals the lens cover on there. So uh, push it back, uh, inset, and then now you're going to have to twist counterclockwise and pull up on this bulb. And it looks like this bulb broke. So I'm going to show you, in case this happens to you, how to remove it. I'm just going to use some needle nose pliers, but remember, you're going to have to turn counterclockwise and then pull up. So I'm turning it slightly counterclockwise. I'm going to show you a close up on this, and then I pull up to remove it. This bulb has two little buttons on each side. You can see one there, and I'll show you a close up that fits into these little slots. So the slots, as you can see, when you remove it, it's counterclockwise. When you're installing it, you're going to push down and turn it clockwise. The bulb replacement we're going to use is the Sylvania 1157 Long Life Bulbs. Also, if you can use nitrile gloves when handling the bulb and not using your bare finger, the oils from your skin can cause a bulb to burn out prematurely. So that's why I use the glove. So notice I'm aligning the buttons in the little slots. Um, and then I'm going to push down. So I'm going to do it again here pushing it down and then I'm turning it clockwise to lock it in. And that's all you need to do. So then of course I turn the lights on to test it. Then you want to inspect the gasket. Just make sure there's no debris or damage um, or clean anything out and then just go ahead and replace the lens. Line up the holes. Remember the reverse lights are on top and then uh, put it on fast speed to just put the screws back in. And then you're done. Now just to show you, the reverse light bulb is above. That's in that uh, section above, so you would access it the same way if you were replacing it, and it is a different bulb. If that video helped you, please like it and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.